going everybody, my name is Chris, and welcome back to some more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker HD Visually Blind. In the last episode, we made it to Horseshoe Island, and we got like freaking gosh dang three cherry charges from there. It's crazy, man. It's so crazy. And also, told you guys I would look up in between episodes since we found old man ho o -Oh. Actually, I've been calling him ho o -Oh, but I just now found out his name is actually Ho-Ho. I know, weird, right? <laughs> Um, and it turns out he's seriously just looking at nothing. He's just there to throw you off like a freaking dinkle, like a freaking dingleberry pie. I, I don't know. Um, so now we made a freaking outside island. We're back home again. Yay! But it's going to be very short-lived because we're actually skipping over this for now. Which, I mean, makes you wonder, like, what the heck, Chris? Why the heck would you skip over your favorite island in the game? All right, one, two, three, four. Okay, so you only need, like... Two things from Beetle here. But we're actually going to come back to this place since there is something I want to get before we tackle on out to the island because I'm going to freaking need it. I want to see what happens if I do this. Let me show you this, Mr. Beetle guy. You want to use your complimentary ID? Okay, here it goes. You are so great, absolutely fantastic, incredible! And there you go. Isn't it nice to be complimented once in a while? It is, isn't it? And you have full hearts. Is that it? Is that really it? Really? That's awesome! I didn't know- I forgot about that. Actually, I probably knew that. I probably used that before. That's- that's awesome and hilarious. Alright, let's get a bunch of all-purpose bait. All-purpose master bait. How many points do we have so far? We're gonna probably have to do here soon. Thank you! 36, okay. Let's just buy one more just to be safe. No, we'll also buy an extra hoi pair because now we have the room because we're not gonna need any bait after these next few islands here. That's sad. Oh, my freaking phone! Shut up, phone! Shut up, Facebook notification telling me I've been taking a post of probably a stupid video. <sighs> Alright. So, yeah, unfortunately, we have to come back to Outside Island. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I've been like saying, oh, we're gonna make it Outside Island this episode, guys, and then it, it just doesn't happen. <laughs> When I finally get here, I'm like, you know what? Let's just skip over it for now. Not because, not by choice. Oh man. Uh, wait. I was hitting the right button there. Jeez. Slowing down takes forever with this freaking sail. Am I not hitting the right button? Why is my? Oh, you know, I was hitting cruise instead of stop. Okay. Oh wow, I was already on the chart and I'm right on top of it. Dang. I was going all over the place. So I thought for sure I would have been like, I don't know. Way off course or some crap. All right, let's see, let's see what we got. What we got? What we got? What do we got? <gasps> we got an orange root bean. Come on. <laughs> All right, so there we go. Now we're done here for now. We will be back very shortly. Um, what we need to do? Oh crap! What I didn't do in between episodes that I wanted to do was. Oops! I don't care about that chart. Let's check my charts here. Make sure I'm not gonna be missing anything vital. Angle. I well, don't really care about that currently. Octo chart. Okay, so we are going to be fighting an Octo this episode. Platform chart is the only other one. Okay, we're also... Oh, man. So we might not even make it back to Outside Island this episode. Well, it's not entirely true. Because next island is where we... I believe this is where... Um, this is the Earth Temple, I believe. It's down island. So we've already dealt with pretty much everything here. The only thing, there's one heart piece we could actually get now. Actually, we could we could have gotten it the very first time we were here. I don't know why I didn't. I probably easily could have. Um, all right. So we see there's some gals over here. All right, uh, let's go get this. All right. Let's look right over me. Oh really? I thought it was like the next two swells over. Well, dang! Wow, I really was wrong about that. Treasure chart! I mean, not uh, treasure chart, it's a treasure chest. Oh, there should be a treasure chart in here now. Or not treasure chart, it's like, you know, a sea chart. You got a silver rupee! Okay, great. Hmm. So, we that some of these, I'll only give you 100 rupees. Well, we did just get the chart from, um. Um, freaking Torshu Island just two seconds ago. Okay, I, I forgot what I was trying to get here. No! I want. Ah, stupid! There we go. Freaking use a hoig pair. A hoig pair. So I guess now he pretty much. <laughs> I love how he uh, flies through like between the King of Red Lions hat. Hey, look at the bottle. Can I get it? It's also really weird to me how it's permanently day in this square. I think I've mentioned that before. Like, there's no reason for it to be permanently day, but it is. Well, might as well get these rupees. Ah, oh, camera. 
Oh, these are freaking magic pots. Well then, I don't understand. <laughs> Why? Why, SpongeBob? Why? Is that a red? Oh, that's a blue rupee. At first, I thought it was a green. I was like, wait, is that a red? No, it's not. That's Lello. We are Lello, Lello, Lello. It's so weird just collecting a heart piece like that and nothing happens. We, I believe we will get a little cutscene once we quit here in a second. Is there anything else we could like just quickly explore with this island? That's a very flat rock face right there. Like, right here. It's like very sharp looking. It's like if you touch that with your bum, prepare to get a splitting bum ache. It's like a headache, but you know, a bum ache instead. Alright. Let's collect this blue rupee just because then we'll say screw it. Yeah! And you got a piece of heart. You collected a total of two pieces. Yeah. All right, and that's all she wrote or something. I don't know. Um, we want to go east, north, south, east, and west. We have tattoos on our chest and stuff. Da -da 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 -da. Zipper Larry. All right. So, I believe what we're coming to right now is called Two Eye Reef, and that's where a lot of shenanigans happens. All right. Let's go to the watchtower place first. So, I've been talk- oh, 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 you know what, this, this is actually better for me to do first, right here. It's all these two gals, let's do this now before we lose them. This is the last big octo of the game, and this is what I've been talking about forever. It's so freaking annoying <laughs> that I didn't fight this guy, I should have fought this guy to begin with. I should have, I didn't realize I'd be so far in my travels that I'd be getting this. Oh well, this is kind of too late, and we've survived so far without this upgrade. So yeah, we swing around here. Yeah, he only has four eyes, so he's only have one eye back here. So weird. Oh, blah, 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 blah. And down you go. Bye bye, asshole. Bye bye. Wee! Say goodbye to the last octo. We have now cleared the seas, you guys. Everything's fine and dandy. There we go. The last great fairy of the game. And I got teleported. I was behind her. Oh, waker of the winds. Thanks to you, I have been freed from the beast's foul gris grasp. Gris grasp. <laughs> As thanks, I shall give you a little of my power. <gasps> Ew, she spit all over me. Ooh, great fairy spits. Ah, <laughs> your magic power has been increased. You now have twice as much as what you had before. May the winds of fortune always blow across your bow. Your bow. I don't freak your brow. The sweat from your brows. <laughs> Thank you, Great Fairy. It means a lot to me. Wow, this tower is really close to the sea. Jeez, is there even a ladder? I could just pretty much step on that from my boat. I could seriously climb up to the top of my mast. I pretty much climb on top of this thing. Well, not really, but, you know, I like to exaggerate things sometimes. Wow, the seas are calm today. That's such a cool thing. Like, you know it's a good game when you can actually say, wow, the seas are pretty calm today. It's really cool. Oh, asshole. Ah, uh, freaking stupid bird. Stupid bird. Hey, let me climb up here in place, please. Are you let me climb up here? What is going on in here? Is this supposed to be a, like, this is the game's representation that we're might be like, where the equivalent of Antarctica would be in this game. Ha <laughs> ha like that. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> you got hit in the head with two coconuts. Name that quote. You can't, well, you should be able to. You silly butthole. And dead. And. Dead! Wow, that was awesome. That bomb landed right beside him. <laughs> Alright. Oh no! Ah, poopies. There's no cannons on here. Yeah, this the one doesn't even have cannons. How very embarrassing. Can I. Can I just freaking break this? I should be able to break that ice. Can I blow up ice? That'd be cool. That'd make sense, too. Um, Alright, let's grab a fire arrows out. But let's face it, it's not gonna work. Because, you know, the game hates me and stuff. I feel like that bomb explosion actually moved me to tears. It was great. Yeah, I really like the addition to this game that you can move when you have like a thing like arrows out or your hook shot. Something that puts you in like a first person view mode. Yeah, I'll take that magic. Wow, it's so awesome to finally have double magic. Should have gotten that a very long time ago. Yeah, 50 rupees. Yay. 
So yeah, this is the whole reason why we didn't go to Outside Island first. I know, it's really stupid and annoying, but I really do need this magic upgrade. I mean, I don't necessarily need it, but it's probably for the best that I grabbed it. Because if I didn't grab it, then, well, it would have sucked. It would have been horrible to do what we're about to do on Outside Island, which I think is going to probably be the hardest part of the game for me. I'm a little bit scared, to be honest. Um, it's going to probably be very terrifying times. 78 bombs, wow. That's not very many. Alright, pull this asshole up. We probably don't need to, to be fair, but it might make things a bit easier for me. Alright. Well, got a fish guy over here. Might as well go do a fish guy now. Do as much as we can so we don't have to backtrack and waste more time than we already are. <laughs> yeah, right. We're wasting so much time and stuffs. Ooh. Nom, 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 nom. Boy, smart friend! Yeah, yeah, see chart and stuff. Wow, we were actually, I mean, all, the only thing we have to do is finish up this island, then we're gonna go back to Outset. We're not gonna do the last few islands, we'll go do those after we deal with what we wanna do on Outset, because I just wanna get there. I tell you, lately, no one around these waters has seen a beautiful fairy who bestows, has seen the beautiful fairy who bestows magic power. She used to live here, Fry. All no one ever sees anymore are the big octos that have been appearing lately. Maybe they scared her off. Oh no, I sure hope they didn't eat her. I vaguely remember him saying that from whenever the last time I played this and saw that fish. Maybe I watched someone. I don't freaking know. Alright. Let's go in here. Um, see, there's a shine shine light. The shine bright like a light. Uh, uh, dang, I tried to move out of the way, but I failed. No! We can reverse control. Ah! Get away from me! Oh, I thought that guy was gonna sink. He did not. He did not sink. He did the opposite. Well, how'd I miss? Eh! What else do we got here? Is there one over there? No? Jeez. Where, where else do we got? Uh, that's not it, is it? I didn't think so. Okay, there's. looks like there's one here. Man. One. Man. Might be it. Yeah! Oh, look at all the skulls over there. Jeez. Two, four, six people died there. Maybe there's just a bunch of skull enthousi enthusiasts in this game. They're like, oh, must collect all the skulls. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. All right, let's see here. Let's see the charts we can find. So another thing we're going to have to do soon is we're going to have to go backtrack and find all the, get the rest of the sea charts or like the rest of the treasures from the bottom of the ocean that we didn't get the first trip. But it doesn't look like there's really too many we have to get still. So that won't take too much time. Not this one, is it? No, it's definitely has more than two eyes. Is it this one? Could be this one. Oh, this, actually, let's just let's let's do this a smarter way. Let's leave. Till it appears again. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, sucker. Brother or something. Okay. Things actually right over me. We probably don't even need it. Or we totally do. Oh, okay, there we go. There was this one. Would you look at that? Mario! I don't know why Mario. Come on, I'm like right on top of it. Is that over here? I think this will be okay. Are you serious? Come on, I'm right on top of it. Which way does he even want me to go? Maybe a bit this way? Stop. Come on, this should work. Okay, I was gonna say. Jeez Louise. All right, see what we've got in here. Go grab the treasure chart and we'll freaking, we're, we're gonna even teleport to, out to the island. I mean, we just need to get there. I miss my mommy, you know, or my granny. I don't have a mommy. Oh, I, I was like, why is there still a glowy spot? It's because there's a million and one glowy spots in here that I don't care about. <laughs> we actually might reach, actually we're probably, I can almost guarantee you we're gonna actually hit the the max rupee count. By the end, we're that when we're done outside the island here, I think we're gonna be getting a lot of rupees from the thing we're about to do. The Savage Labyrinth. Yeah, does that name sound scary to you? It should. All right, where even is this treasure chest? Is it on this first eye? Oh, it is on this first eye. Okay, that's really easy. That's really easy, geez. Just gotta go over here and wow. Is this the last reef? Is this the last time I'm gonna get to experience this? Ah, I just punched my freaking god dang pop filter. So you guys might not have heard that, so it was just the pop filter. The pop filters connect to the Pop filter clamp. The pop filter clamp is connected to the mic boom 
arm thing. The mic boom arm thing is connected to the microphone. The microphone's connected to the my face voice. <laughs> Uh, in a nutshell, I'm trying to tell you guys. You guys might have heard a bang there, and I apologize. You got a treasure char. There's a map on the map screen. The map, 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 map screen. The only thing that would maybe make this better is if I went into this savage labyrinth with full hearts. But you know what? Let's not go in there completely prepared. Although, if we die, I'm going to be really sad. I'm going to be really sad if we die towards the end. Oh man, that would be so like disheartening. If I spent like an hour and a half... Doing the Savage Labyrinth. I don't know how long it actually takes. I don't think it's like I don't think it's that long. It's probably like 40 minutes, maybe some. Well, even like that's quite a while. If I get to the very end and die in like one of the last ones, and that would suck horribly. See, there's a fair island over there. All right, we're finally done, you guys. And by f wait, we did get the fish here, right? Whoa! I did not know we could see this when we we're from this screen. Cool. We did. Did we get the... Okay, we did definitely get the map fish. Okay, I thought so. Well, I want to double check. So I didn't confuzzle myself when I came back here. Alright, the blad of the ghouls. Alright. Outside islands. Let's go! That'd be so scary. Imagine getting flung out. I mean, you're spinning at a very violent pace. That'd be so scary, man. Why can't just gracefully pick me up? Um, I'm definitely gonna want to. Well, look at the seagulls. It's like you, it almost makes you think there's a big octo that invaded the island. That just kind of sitting on top of the island. Wouldn't that just be awesome? The answer is yes. Yes, it would. All right. That's cool. Standing on like the shore here. Oh, that's really cool. I don't know why. I mean, there's nothing really impressive about it, but it just looks really cool to me. Am I the only one? All right, let's visit everybody. Hello. We don't got any mail anymore. Are we gonna ever get mail for the rest of this game? We might not. It's kind of sad. We're definitely creeping up towards the end here, you guys. Is there no one out? I was gonna say, jeez. I mean, I don't think anyone's gonna say anything special. Let's just begin appearing. To yeah, okay. They just say the same thing that they said last time. Here. Well, never mind that then. All right. So, what's new here? I mean, besides the giant freaking pig that we already saw last time, so it's not even new. <laughs> I said that's like, oh, you know what? We are gonna go to Grandma. Sorry, I'm running in circles here. I apologize. Gonna go to Grandma and get our refill of our soup. We are definitely gonna need it. I really hope I'm not making this sound like really difficult and like have the easiest time in the world with it. That's entirely possible. I should stock up in items as well. Maybe even grind for items. Like, we don't have many, many, many very bombs. Yep, that's right. Many very bombs. Will you give me soup even while I'm half Link? Link. If you're running out of Grandma's homemade soup, come see me. Yeah, yeah. Granny soup. I gotcha. Grandma! I'm gonna drink your soup you gave me like three weeks ago. Give me soup. Yes, please. I like how they make absolute sure you can't like get more than one elixir soup because otherwise it'd be really freaking overpowered. That'd be what? If you had all 20 hearts, oh man, times 8. 20? Okay, 2 times 8. That'd be 160 hearts if we were allowed to take as much, like if we were allowed to fill all four of our bottles with soup. 160 hearts. That is insane. Plus like, you know, oh, well, I can't really say that because there's... The, the item, if you know the last item that goes in this slot down here, if you know what's in there, like if you add that in, then, I mean, you can stay alive for quite a little while. Alright. Okay, so. Jump up here. Okay, we gotta climb this mountain. That actually might be another way to get up to where we need to go. Cause I mean, you may be wondering, like, what the heck am I talking about Savage Labyrinth? Like, we, this is our home. How have you not seen this Savage Labyrinth yet? I really want that rupee, but we're gonna leave it. <laughs> it's just beckoning to me, and I guarantee that's why it's there too, just to beckon to you, like, no, you want me. <laughs> I don't know, we had a freaking Ren Stimpy voice there. I don't remember which is which. I never. I don't think I really watched that show too much. I almost feel like that might have been a show that my parents were like, mm, "No, we're not gonna let you watch that, Chris." 
as a little baby child because I mean, whoa, holy crap, I am standing right on the edge. I'm living on the edge. All right, so west. I like how they made that like perfectly west. I almost wonder if, whoa, that scared me. My heart dropped. No, jump up. I almost wonder if they made that like directly west just because they knew this would be one of the very first times. Well, I guess it wouldn't be one of the first times you used your Deku Leaf. I guess it would be one of the first times you used your Deku Leaf outside like the Forbidden Woods though. Where you absolutely need to use it. Alright, so we're going through here for a particular reason. That is, we need fairies! Hello! Oh jeez, holy crap, I thought you were just the Bokublin. Are you gonna attack me? Oh, are you serious? What? Get the freaking stupid head going through the freaking ground? Come on, man. All right, let's get down here. I mean, we're gonna get our life back since we. The whole reason we're coming down here is to get fairies, right? Um. All right, let's use all our freaking bottles. But I'm, I'm sad because now we lost our double damage. <laughs> oh man, look at all the bottles are in inventory. It's awesome. All right, let's fill our bottles first. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Hopefully not use a fairy by mistake. Monster by mistake. That's what I that remember. Anyone remember that show? I barely remember what that show even looks like. I just remember whenever this guy sneezes, he turns into a like hideous monster. <laughs> hideous monster. That's great. Um, hmm, I guess that, and maybe uh, let's try that for now. I guess I don't freaking know. Yay, spam fairies! I love it. I love the sound. It's so rewarding. So gratifying. Alright, now we need to escape here real quick. Real quick, like. Hopefully not get hit by these assholes. Oh, you know, that's exactly why those assholes are here. Did you just kill them all? Well, not all of them. Some of them we did. Ow! Jeez, this place grows in real quick. They actually made a really good job of making this place look like a crowded, overgrown forest. Even though it's really not, it shouldn't be that impressive because, I mean, it's really not, but. Uh, it almost looks like you get up there, but no, you cannot. I don't even think we can make this jump, can we? I can almost guarantee you we can't. Well, that's kind of unfortunate, so we have to make our way up the mountain. One second, you guys! Oh, I was gonna say, I better not land on that rock and take damage. Okay, we're back. So here's Mr. Ho Ho. Not Ho Ho. Ho, oh, oh, ho, so close. If I could fly at the top of that hill, if only be the rock here, the triumph. Oh, I normally spoke aloud without thinking it is a secret. Yes, quite a secret. All right, so, I mean, we don't even need our telescope for that. Just look at that. Look at that very obvious headstone. Very ominous. <laughs> look at his stupid eye. His red eye from staring in that telescope for so long. Or maybe it's his red eye because he's on that dank wee shit. Ow! Sorry, that's really stupid. Okay, I hope that's good. Um, well, telly ho! Is that racist? I don't know if that's racist. Uh-huh. Alright. So far, so good. I almost wonder if you need double magic for this. Oh, wow. This is not a good wind direction, maybe. Well, okay. This is pretty... The, this, wow, okay. Maybe this isn't a good idea. Are you going to make it? But we definitely would not have made that with just normal magic. Alright. Oh, great. It gives us the magic back. Woo! Alright. So, this is the place he was looking at. And look, the headstone is overlooking the island. I have to make the game go to joke. Hello! This is my head. Why can't I find a date? No, that was stupid, you say. Well, I agree. <laughs> oh boy, you guys. I can't believe we're about to do this. By the way, I found this bottle while coming up here. Darren! What, what even is that? Looks like a hand? Sparkles? I don't know what that could possibly be. There's water. I, I don't know. I, hmm, whatever. That's kind of scary. <laughs> In the next episode, we will descend into madness and face our fears. In the Savage Labyrinth. Dun, dun, dun. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.